That doesn't sound great. Fingers crossed. Okay, guys. Oh, no. Okay, well. Let's see if it can be remedied. Let's, let's just see. Well, hello. How are you? I'm good. I am really good. I'm a little warm, but you know, this heat is just going to be the death of me. I swear it. But other than that, I'm good because I got some Timu goodies to share with y'all. So we got to get, we got to get into it. <laughs> Who's ready? Who's ready to dig in? Hmm? Rip on into it. All right, so first things first, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. Let's put on my spectacles and see if I can figure this out. What is this? Shadow pen? Okay, let's open it up. It looks like an eyeliner pen. Actually. Oh, come on. <laughs> this plastic doesn't want to come off. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to smack myself in the face there for a minute. Oh, my goodness. And I will put all of the prices that are current as of the time of filming down on the screen somewhere. Um, but Timu, you know, they're always having fabulous sales and everything else that they're, the prices are just constantly changing and maybe cheaper and maybe a little bit more, but add it to your cart if you want it. And then you can watch the prices fluctuate until it gets to a place that you want to purchase it. So here's the liner. And that is the color. I guess I got like a brown. Oh, that is very light. Very, very light. Can you see it there? Right there. This must, I must have thought to do this for my eyebrows. I wonder, let's, let's see. Where's my mirror? <laughs> mirror. That's such a weird word, but. I think this might be too light for my brows, actually, but I thought it might be good to have some contrasting color, I'm betting. So it's just not always the dark. It's not bad, you guys. It does have a fine line. You see that? So you're not, you know, you just don't press hard and you get the hair like stroke. Okay. Yeah, this looks good. And then if I had a darker color, go in with a darker color a little bit because our hair is not one color, <laughs> you know, it's not one color. I'm just gonna go ahead and stick this in my little bag that goes in my purse. Ooh. Without tossing it all over the place. Okay, what else we got? Oh, well, we've got... Shocking. I know, I know. But in my defense, these are by an artist, so it's worth it. I mean, they're not by the artist, but it's based off of his art. And it's escaping me right now. Um, Monet. Oh, based off of his garden. Okay. 
That's all. I just need to cool down real quick. But look at these. Come on. Wouldn't this be beautiful for like, if you were making a journal to do not necessarily like a garden journal. I know it's Monet's garden, but like spring, summer, like that would be super cute. Super duper cute. Pretty, these would be beautiful in a journal. Anyway, really, I mean, they're honestly so pretty. And I like that it has a box, although they'll probably go on the washi wall, to be honest. So. Oh, maybe this is another eyebrow pen. It looks like a darker color. Mm-hmm, it's a darker color. Let's see. Yeah. See? A little bit of definition. <laughs> not too bad. Not too bad at all. I'm a little hot and sweaty, though. It's a little warm. I think it's the dress, to be honest, because it's not the most breathable material, but it's such a cute dress. It's such a cute dress. Maybe I should pull my hair back. Do I have my clip? I thought I had a clip out. I do. Let me pull my hair back real quick. Real quick. Oh, almost flew out of my hands. I would have been so sad, you guys. Okay, it's not going to stay up for very long. Oh. <laughs> now, I've mentioned this before. My longtime viewers will probably remember I was definitely a Twilight mom. So I have a mood bag, which is a purse that a lot of us haulers have got. It's made out of canvas and you can stick all of your pins on them. So I've been recollecting pins and this is Rosalie and Emmett from Twilight. <laughs> There's more of those. <laughs> I'm excited about those because I want them on my bag and I can actually tell you that that, I need my spectacles. They were $159, which is not bad. Okay. Got these for the doggos. I did get two of them. I think they were in separate orders, though. They got shipped separately, which is so ridiculous. But this was $0.48. Cents, and it's just to keep in the car. To keep in the car. For the doggos. So we have a place for them to get some water, you know. A little thirsty. Little hydration. Especially with how hot it's been, you know what I mean? Gotta take care of those doggos. I think this is the die set that goes with a stamp set. Yes, it is. That I hauled in a previous haul. Now, they were bought together but they came separately. And this is to cut out the same shape from the stamps. So I can cut them out and then I can stamp them or I can stamp them and try to line them up. These are some really cool like retro funky numbers. I think this is a typewriter, like a light bulb, I think. I can't remember what the stamps all were, but yeah, I'm excited about that. I've been waiting for that. Okay, now, I believe this was Kim, who may have mentioned this. Now, I don't think that this was the idea she was thinking of, but this is the route that I went. Because it is, you know, spring and summer, well, it's summer now, and my flower pillows are all starting to come back out. I've been slow getting them out because I'm moving my studio upstairs, so I don't want to get a bunch of stuff out yet. Anyway, <clears throat> I've been getting some bugs and I got that cute little spider that's sitting over there right now and my little Norbert and my little um, cicada and she goes, well, you should get a stuffed ant. Look it up on Timu. <laughs> so I did. 
and I found a stuffed ant and it looked like they designed it to look like a real ant but like you're seeing it large because it was big and it was detailed and I was like I can't I can't do it but then they had this little ant <laughs> and I said okay I can handle <laughs> I can handle this little ant so now I need a name for this little ant and he's got which is really funny because our dog em um, Ember has a floppy ear and so does this one Oh, you fit right in. You fit right in. So, Kim, there's your aunt. <laughs> I'm sure you were wanting me to get the other one, but mm, mm, mm. <laughs> no, thank you. Oh, this is so big. <laughs> okay, what is all this stuff? Okay, oh, this is another temporary tattoo. Look at how pretty that is. I think the model had it like wrapped around or like down her arm. I can't remember, but I love the line art style tattoos. I thought that would be really pretty to play with. That doesn't sound great. Fingers crossed. Okay, guys. Oh no. Okay, well, let's see if it can be remedied. Let's let's just see. These are little candle votive lanterns. There's one piece of glass that is knocked out. I don't know that it's broken. Um, they have styrofoam in here to prevent that from happening, but it happened anyway. They did try. So I try to open it up and it's a little double door, which is really cool. You see, they had that in there. This little blue piece fell out. So let's put that back. Looks like it slides in to these little holders. Come on, get in there. Okay. doesn't want to go past that point because something is up. Yeah, that piece is up. Let me bend that down a little bit. Okay. There we go. Okay, perfect. Good. It's not broken. And then it's got the little lock. But I have little things that I can hang from my ceiling and I wanted to hang these with some little votive, um, the flameless, you know. Um, I think there's two of these. Let's hope that this is another one and that it's not broken. I mean, it's so bent. Oh, okay. This one's just already open. I'm sorry that was really loud okay this one was not even broken so that's good but yeah so I got two of these to hang from the ceiling get a little uh, bohemian Moroccan flair to my garden room how pretty are those it's gonna give off some really pretty light you guys I wish I had a little candle I would put it in there and show you well good I'm glad they're not broken when they come clinking like that, it scares me. Oh, and I think these go with the other little hanging things that I got. I think these are like the little chains so I don't have to use fishing wire, I think. And it, I can't remember if it was like a pack of six or... Yeah, it was six pieces. I thought I got like antique silver, but, or bronze, maybe not. I may have gotten black. Which surprises me because I don't normally choose, like, the black. I usually choose the antique. But, okay, so you've got, like, the hooks. And then you've got the chain. And then you've got, like, a little clasp here. So, like, you can have the clasp hooked up at top if you want. And then hook. How long? 
hook the hook. Oh, I may have gotten black to match some of these. You can do it like that and then have it hanging or vice versa. You can put the hook on the, the ceiling and then if you, you know you're not gonna be taking it down that often, you could, it doesn't wanna open. It's like stuck together. Well, I'll just not mess with that one. <laughs> The little, the little other side didn't want to open. Maybe they're not meant to open. They might be sealed shut. I don't know. I'll have to play with those. But anyway, that's just so weird to me. They just don't, usually you could just kind of pop it like that. But anyway, that's fine because I could just hoop it over. But yeah, I wanted that to have them hang down so I didn't have to use fishing wire. And so they had two bags with three in each. Oh, I'm excited. I can get these hung up. And also I have that beautiful, if you've been here, thank you so much for coming back. And if you're new here, welcome. I have seen new subscribers and I'm just so happy to have you. And you came at the nick of time because I'm getting ready to do my 2000 subscriber giveaway. So stay tuned, hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything that I upload. Um, okay. Oh, we got another pen, we got another pen. Oh, it's Bella and Edward. How cute, huh? When they were walking up, when he showed up, they showed up to, at school together for the first time. That's what that scene was. <laughs> I love the, the Twilight movies. I really did. Okay, now I've gotten this ring before and I got it in a different size. And I think, I don't know what size this one is. Um, I think, I, yeah, this one was supposed to fit the pinky. Cause I technically wanted it for the pinky and then it sold out. So I got it for an, another size cause I was wanting it. But now I have it on the pinky. Look at how pretty that is. It's not like moistenite or anything. It is a little tight, which is shocking because <laughs> it doesn't want to come off <laughs> because usually that size fits my pinky really well, but it doesn't say what size is on here. Oh, well, it's really pretty though. It, it's like art deco to me, you know? I don't know, it's really pretty though. I love that style. We got another pen. I bet you this is uh, uh, Alice and Jasper. Yep. Alice and Jasper. Aren't these cute? And thank you to the subscriber who told me about the pin locks on Timu because I have them now and I use them and I love them. Okay, what is this? It's something wrapped in plastic. You know, for as late as it is, there are sure enough people on the road. Yes, I'm doing it late. It's like the only time I ever have right now. Okay. Got off, what are you? The Mia Show. Shiny neon lipstick. I, I don't recall ever buying neon lipstick. Is that what it says? Right on the bottom? Can't even read that. I don't know, it looks like neon lipstick to me. Yeah, it says neon, shiny neon lipstick. I did not. There's no way. Stupid lighting. Anyway, let's see together. Oh, well, that wasn't. Oh, it's the glitter one. Look at that, you guys. Oh, oh my God. Stop it. Oh my God. That's stupid. I'll wipe some of the glitter off. Okay, let me see. I need, I need, I need something. How about you? You'll do. Get off my hand real quick. 
paint that other lipstick off. Let's try it. It's so pretty. Wow, <laughs> some shiny lips right there. Okay, I, I mean, I wouldn't call them neon, but that's very interesting color. <laughs> oh no, I don't know, I don't know. What do you guys think? I don't know, it's a weird color, we'll see. I just, I'm so used to just like my bomb, you know, at least it doesn't taste bad. It just seems a little, I don't know, not with this dress. I got to take it off, you guys. <laughs> I don't know that I like it. I think it's such a pretty color, but like, I don't know if it works on my face, you know, it's like shows up as a pretty pink on here, but I just, it's just too, that yellow, I think it's clashing with the dress. Okay, this I gotta wait on a minute. Oh, okay, here's Esme and Dr. Cohen. The patriarch and matriarch. I think those are all of the Twilight pins that I got. Let's see what else we got. Things stuck. Oh, just a couple more things. Okay. Let's open this. <laughs> this, my friends, is a wig head. Oh, it's tied so tight, you guys. Okay. Sorry. It comes with um, a ball joint and an attachment for like a table. So I can put her on that. I guess I can take it out and show you. So see, it can go on the table. And then this screws onto this. But first, I must put the ball joint. Oh, I put this through here. So it holds the ball joint and then I do this and you can tighten it when you have it where you want it. I want to keep some of the plastic nice, but this is um, a nice canvas and the head just goes on like that. And so then you can move it around, put your wig on it. And I also hauled, where'd it go? Pins to help me hold like a wig on so I can style it. And I thought that would be really handy, especially with all the wigs I've been buying. So this will be fun. And then also when I'm working on a character, there's gonna be wigs that need to be styled. And this will make it so much easier. For me. Okay. This will make it so much easier for me to style than when it's on my own head. So I figured why not? Timu's got good prices. So Okay, and then look at how pretty that box is. To go along with my musical instrument collection that I'm building up. This is a beautiful little I guess finger piano I don't know it comes with all the goodies the tuner the little finger guard things and then the booklet it comes with all kinds of stuff the item comes in a burlap bag wrapped it's probably not tuned but look at that 
Isn't that pretty? It's got the notes here. Can I not drop it? That's really cool. That's gonna be very fun to learn, soothing. I'm waiting on my husband to uh, tune the string instruments that I've purchased so I can start fiddling around for you guys. But I thought, you know, these things are just fun to have around, especially when you've got little ones because little ones are always so enthused about music. And I wanna have all kinds of different things that they can play with, you know? Okay, now. I'm gonna take this off because we got, this is the last item. It comes with the GRA card, a little bent up, a little bent up. Got the GRA card right there. If that's important for you. And then it comes in its little red box and in a bag inside the red box. Oh, and I believe this is a this is a doozy one. This is a big one. I think this was um quite a lot of carrots. Let's see. 10 carrots. Look at that. That is fancy. If you wear this out, you will be robbed. <laughs> Dang, that is massive. I'm gonna put the little flower one away for right now. I'm gonna wear this, see what my husband says about it. Oop, are you too big for this box? Okay, I put my other ring in here. For now, don't let me forget, please. Don't let me forget. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna show you this ring one more time because it's just so pretty. I like the band also. And this is sterling silver. It's stamped. Right there. But also look at the band. I know you probably can't see the stamping, but it's there. You see the band? It's so pretty. And the sparkle on this thing? Golly. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's a nice way to end. And I cannot wait. We're, we're starting to work on setting up the studio now. Upstairs. Um... My daughter is no longer needing the space. So now we're gonna really get it set up nice. And uh, we have those new air conditioner, or one unit, one air conditioner unit of the two that we purchased off of Timu. If you haven't seen that video, go watch the Timu and chill. <laughs> You'll get to see a window unit air conditioner be installed that we purchased off of Timu and uh, get a little review off of that. Not just an unboxing, but um, I'm going to set up my studio and I'm going to have an area for this kind of stuff. So I'm excited. I'm excited for a lot of the things in here. What was your favorite? It's so hard to choose when there's like jewelry and useful things and decorative items because like these are in my top favorite. The music instrument. The bling. <laughs> the little ant. The pins. I mean, come on. You know, I mean, there's just so many fun things. How can you, how can you pick a favorite? There was a lot of really good things in here. So, but I want to know what you think. What, what did you like? Now I'm, I'm a little cooled down. I can let my hair back down because good Lord. I don't know. I had a hot flash or something because it came out of nowhere. Look at this, you guys. I've used the rice 
water shampoo bar and conditioner a second time and I've used the the mask a second time my hair is so soft you guys it feels fantastic anyway it doesn't matter <laughs> um yeah so that's it that's all I have for you guys I hope you enjoyed the haul I have uh, more bags a coming <laughs> more stuff are coming. So, uh, stay tuned, stay tuned. And I got lots of fun stuff to share with you. Lots of fun things happening. So, okay. Anyway, that's it. That's all I have. I don't need to ramble anymore. I need to let y'all go and live your life. And I'm going to go get ready for bed. I'm tired. So I hope you're having a fantastic morning, afternoon, evening, whatever it is, wherever you are, make it a good one, a happy one, and a restful one. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now. <laughs> Bye for now. The way I said it, I'm like, yeah. Bye for now. <laughs>